If you were a keen student in history, you must have picked up that a great deal of where we came from was never etched into a stone. Much has pretty much been lost. Thing is, we don't really know what is missing from the patchwork of history. Even archaeologists are having a tough time fitting their findings into some of the discoveries they're making. Nobody knows for sure how some of these artifacts got there, so here are five mysterious discoveries that could completely rewrite history. Let's begin! Number 5. The Markawasi Ruins The jury is still out about the creator of the Markawasi Plains and the Andes Mountains. They are rocks that are sculpted to look like human heads, with one particularly looking like a crude copy of the Egyptian Sphinx. It is possible that these rocks took their shape by random erosion, but there are those who believe that aliens and mystical healing powers may have been responsible. One popular theory comes from an archaeologist who claims the site was built by a biblical civilization called the Masma, who traveled to Peru and carved crude imitation of the wonders they'd seen in Egypt. His theory comes from a dream he had, which is slightly less realistic than the scientific approach to history. Number 4. A Roman Sword In Canada? This sword, found by a TV crew, is estimated to have been left there since 200 AD. That's not the only thing found. Someone has stumbled into a crossbow bolt wedged into a tree, a Roman-style burial mound, Carthaginian coins and a stone with what appears to be Roman writing on it, all made about 1800 years ago. The theory is that a group of Roman and Carthaginian explorers might have traveled out west about 1800 years ago. They may have never made it home and may have buried their dead body on the island. If this is true, then it could change the history of the first Europeans to visit the Americas. Number 3. The Red-Headed Giants of Lovelock Cave The miners in Bavada Lovelock Cave were not expecting to find a massive wealth of mummified remains of 6 foot 6 inch man with red hair in 1911. Also found Indian relics, 15 inch sandals, and a handprint twice the normal human size. These findings are believed to back the Paiute legend about redhead freckled cannibals called the Sitekas. The Paiute narrate that they came by boat and preyed on them until they managed to chase them into a cave that they set on fire. The original red-headed mummy was destroyed, but if this story holds up, it may just be that the Sitekas were a real group of violent European explorers that met their end in Nevada. Number 2. The Giant Village of Peru The Conquistador Pedro Cieza de Leon was the author of the Chronicles of Peru, which documented events of when the Spanish first came to Peru. In his book, Cieza says that giants arrived in boats made of reeds as big as large ships. He narrated, From the knee downward their height was as great as the entire height of an ordinary man. A fire then came and consumed these giants. Could there have really been other foreign visitors to Peru? Who knows? Number 1. North American Legends of White Giants It may be that Greek explorers beat all other European nations in the race to the Americas. In 1875, a Native American of the Comanche tribe stood in front of a crowd and told of how, some innumerable moons ago, a race of rich and powerful white men of about 10 feet high were living in America. It all seemed like a parable, until a Greek medallion and two coins were found in Oklahoma. When geologists started piecing the evidence, it was found not to be an isolated story. The Choctaws also had a story of a race of giants, with white skin, having lived in what is now the state of Tennessee. And there you have five mysterious discoveries that could completely rewrite history. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like and share it. And if you haven't already, subscribe down below to get notified almost every single day with newer videos from Top 5's Finest. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, we are out.